The FDA launched a new generative AI tool it hopes will make employees more efficient on everything from clinical evaluations to inspections. Here are the details. The FDA's new AI tool is called ELSA, and it was developed in-house to help with reading, writing, and summarizing. They want this to modernize the entire FDA, and it's already making a difference. ELSA shortens the time needed for scientific evaluations, summarizes adverse effect reports for medicines and therapeutics, expedites clinical reviews, generates code to develop non-clinical databases, and helps inspectors determine where they're most likely to find violations and safety issues. The FDA said ELSA is secure and relies only on internal documents. All information stays within the agency, and the AI models are not being trained on data submitted by the industry. Even with safeguards, there is potential for error. The Trump administration learned that with the recent release of the Make America Healthy Again report, which cited studies that don't exist. Experts say those types of mistakes happen with generative AI use. They're called AI hallucinations. The federal government is using AI at an increasing rate. In fact, it doubled AI use from 2023 to 2024. According to data collected by the Chief Information Officers Council, the biggest users are the Departments of Health and Human Services, Veterans Affairs, Interior, and Homeland Security. Approximately 46% of the uses are what's described as mission enabling, including finance management, human resources, and facilities and properties management. It's also used for cybersecurity, IT, and other administrative functions. I'm Ray Bogan for Straight Arrow News. For more reporting, download the SAN app.